In this guide, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue where your voice chat is not working inside of the Xbox Game Bar. Now, let's jump straight into it. And the first thing you'll need to do is head over to your start menu and you just need to search for settings and head over to the settings window. From the left hand side, come over to gaming inside of the Game Bar. And first things first, we just need to make sure the Game Bar is actually turned on here. Obviously, without this feature being turned on, you won't be able to use the Game Bar. So once you've got this feature enabled, we then need to head over to apps in the left hand side inside of installed apps and then you need to scroll all the way down to the bottom of this list and come inside of system components inside of here we'll find all of our system applications like the game bar so we're just going to come over to these three horizontal dots click on advanced options and then scroll all the way down to this reset section so firstly we're going to just press this repair button and give that a few seconds to complete and then once you've done that we're going to go ahead and also press this reset button at the bottom and confirm by pressing reset now now, whilst we're still inside of the settings window, we're going to come down to privacy and security on the left hand side, scroll all the way down to microphone and click this. And the first thing you need to do is make sure your microphone access is actually toggled on here. And beneath that, where it says let apps access your microphone, make sure this is also toggled on. And then down here, you'll see a list of applications that require the microphone. Once again, just make sure the game bar is turned on here. Once you've done that, we can then close out of this window and we can try launching up the game bar to see if that fixes the voice chat. If that still doesn't work, another thing that you can do here is come over to your start menu and just search for device manager and then head over to the device manager window. From here, we need to come over to audio inputs and outputs and expand this drop down. Then just locate your microphone from this list. I'm using this Yeti microphone at the top here. So we're just going to right click on this, come into update driver and then press search automatically for drivers. As you can see, I'm already running the latest drivers for my device and we can even go one step further here and press search for updated drivers on Windows Update. Then click this check for updates button and just install any pending updates that you have inside of here. Now this may require you to restart your computer. So go ahead and do that if it's asking you to restart. And then the last thing we're going to do here is come back over to our start menu, search for control panel, and then head over to the control panel icon. Make sure view by is set to large icons, then come over to sound. And from this window, we need to come over to the recording tab, scroll all the way down and just make sure your microphone is set to the default device here. As you can see at the bottom here, I have my microphone and it's enabled and also set to the default device. Then once you've done that, we can press apply and okay to save these changes. And that's it guys, by following all of these steps, that should have now fixed the voice chat inside of the Xbox game bar. If this video did help you, then please consider dropping a like and subscribing and I'll see you in the next one.